In this video, we want to revisit the LED MR16 application. Some time back, we explored the compatibility issue between the LED MR16 and the Quarpo AC transformer, the electronic or magnetic. Such compatibility issue is actually quite common, and you'll recognize it right after you place a halogen with a LED MR16 bulb and found flickering even when there's only simple on-off and no dimming involved. Here, we will explore an alternative option for more demanding applications, which involves the use of a constant current LED driver instead of the 12 volt AC transformer. This is a typical LED MR16 setup, where you can see the dimmable LED MR16 bulb and the 12 volt AC electronic transformer. The transformer provides a step-down function to convert the mains voltage of 220 volt to 12 volt AC. Now on this side, we have the constant current LED MR16 bulb from Sora, which is connected to the LED driver from HEP. In both cases, on the AC side, you have the mains voltage connected to our phase dimmer, the DZ3G450DIAL, before connecting to live input to either the transformer or the LED driver. Now, the difference between the two approaches is that the same 12 volt AC transformer that was connected to the halogen before remains unchanged, but you will need a dimmable version of the 12 volt AC or DC LED MR16 bulb. On the other hand, the 12 constant current approach requires a dimmable LED driver and there's no dimmable LED bulb in this case. For the LED driver selection, since the Sora constant current LED bulb has a typical operating voltage of 28 volt, and if we drive it at spring 15 milliamp, that's slightly less than 10 watt. Hence, we have this driver selected. And let's see how they dim together. Of course, both lamps have different specification, and we won't comment on the CCT nor the CRI performance. And it's our intention to make a short video so that you will be aware of the alternative solution and be aware of how both approaches would perform with our DZ3G450DIAL together. You might consider a constant current LED driver for more demanding applications. Okay, so let's un conclude our video here. To learn more about our demand technology and product benefits, please check out our product page and other videos in the series. Once again, thank you for watching.